the I remember going to hospital, uh, being admitted uh, as a Friday afternoon at about uh, three o'clock, and they just ripped my shirt off, dry shaved my chest, put all these electrolytes on me, and the first um, the the nurse who was uh, doing that um, took my blood pressure. It was 215 over 145, and you know she said you you probably can have a heart attack any second. Um, it was scary. It's um, yeah. I mean, I just got like my. If you were here right now, you'd see that my whole body is full of goosebumps. Yeah. I mean, that is just so close. Mm. But you were, in some ways, you you were at the hospital in that COVID line, weren't you? I was at uh, Calandra Hospital in the COVID yeah. line, um, and we got to about two. Or, um, funny story, we got to about 20 minutes from the front of the line um, and my uh, wife noticed I'd just gone quiet. Um, so she said, are you okay? And I looked at her and the right side of my face had dropped. Um, so she Googled like signs of a stroke and you know, there's five things. You put your arms in the air and you do it, um, do this. And um, I said to her, well, we waited this long for the COVID test, we might as well can just wait 20 minutes more. Um, so we waited. Um, because we've been so long in the line, uh, we we went to McDonald's on the way and uh, had a had a cheeseburger meal, and then um, showed up at Sunshine Coast Hospital. And yeah, they quickly wheeled me in and yeah, dealt with dealt with the um, the uh, the symptoms. And what you just talked about there is is what they call the fast yep. um, treatment, or I can't remember the exact name, so forgive me. See, I'm ha I'm having a moment. <laughs> um, but it's you know with stroke, it's face, arm, speech, but time is wow. of the essence with stroke. Yeah, yep. that's probably yeah, that's probably something that you know I'm I still have the mentality I'm 30 and invin invincible, you know, nothing's wrong with me. Um, it could happen to me. So yeah, you, you think you got all the time in the world to deal with it. Um, and you know, then you read it, then you read now what, what you meant to do. And yeah, it's um, times everything. So yeah, that's something I forgot to ask you. How old were you again? Um, I was 50. Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, as you said, we, we think that we're invincible and we mm. think we've got so much time to do everything. Yeah. And this just sort of shows us that we are not invincible and we don't have time yeah. on our side. That's, that's uh, so, so true. Um yeah, we just, uh, you know, um, it was a good wake-up call. Um, the, there were um, things I, I changed, my habits. Um, I certainly slept more. I uh, compartmentalised uh, my work. My, I prioritised my health mm -hmm. um, to get back to um, the level that I'm back at. I think I'm 93.5% recovered um, officially. Um, so I, I have to work every day to, to you know, try and improve that number to, uh, to get, make a full recovery.